Okay, since ASBC didn't uh, follow our entry criteria yesterday, it was our free pick, um, and we followed up um, telling you why. We thought we would follow up today. It showed up on our radar in the middle of the day. Didn't even have it on our streamer. But um, well, let me go back to the daily real quick. This was yesterday that ended up I'm not following our entry methods, and then this daily candle here show you, shows you today. And in the middle of the day, we found it on a um, intraday scan due to this long base right here. These are five minute candles. And we called it in chat as a buy above 1852 right here. So at 1853, and our stop would have gone our uh, 1834. So less than 20 cent risk. That's what we called it. And uh, it's exactly the type of trade we look for um, when we talk about our intraday base break plays. We we only want them if they're going to be low risk like this, um, as far as where your stop goes. So, and we knew we liked the daily chart already. We don't just pick any random base like this, but we already knew that the daily had room. Uh, the market was strong at this point, so we went ahead and bought at 18.53, and it ran in about let's see, about 20, 25 minutes, all the way to 18.98, and we took profits on the way up. And many of our members made money on that today. So we just wanted to follow up on ASBC simply because it gave a uh, typical um, intraday call that we that we like to make so um, risk reward is, is everything when we trade and, uh, Foster Wheeler another good example we liked it. Um, it we knew if it broke its high of the day of 3535 it had a chance to run um, simply because it's so oversold look at the daily there ignore the green candle because that's today look at that thing from 52 all the way down to 33 you know in a, in a little over a week so we had it on watch for a bounce and then when it came up here and got near the high of the day see this little this little uh, consolidation here we called it if it broke we said in chat if it broke above this high 3515 so our trigger was 3516 and our stop would go right below this low so again low risk as far as where our stop would go um, and you can see it never came close to our stop. So we triggered at 35.16, and this thing went all the way up to 36.39. Um, that's over a dollar a share. You had a thousand shares. Uh, real nice trade there for the day. So that's just another example of our intraday calls that we talk about. And again, we'll look to send out another free pick uh, early next week.